What is going on YouTube and welcome back. Today we are taking a closer look at that collection that I purchased uh, a couple of days ago of all the Morgan and Peace silver dollar uh, hobo art coins. And I just, I, we went through that video so quickly for the unboxing. You guys really didn't get a good look at all of the coins. And so I thought what I would do is go ahead and do another video and just kind of give you some up close and personal looks at all the coins. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to zoom in just a little bit more even. Let's pull these out of the way. And I'm just going to show you all of the coins. There's 15 in all. Each one of them is handcrafted. They're all a little bit different. This one's a 21 Morgan. And you can see the detail there in the face. Let's zoom in on that real quick, just a little bit. Oh, that's as far as I can go, actually. But as you can see, I mean, there's a lot of details in there. Uh, and this is, like I said, all hand done. There's the reverse side of it. Then we got a 1924 piece dollar. You can kind of see right here where he took some of the details out of the coin. So you'll kind of see little areas where they kind of sand it down to, to remove some of the details and then uh, then they add in their own details. But each one of these is just a little bit different. Sometimes they might be looking down, sometimes they might be looking up. The face, the facial uh, differences are pretty crazy. I mean, it's for, you know, they're all supposed to be the same. This one, look at this one. He took all the hair out. This one's completely bald, but look at the neck bones in that one. Super detailed. The teeth, the jaw lines, everything is really, really detailed. And imagine getting in between each one of these little points. That's crazy. I mean, they took a lot of time to do this. The artist is really great. Another Morgan, just a little bit different. Each time they're just a little bit more different. Let's check out the back of that. All right. We have another Morgan. I'm gonna to switch to this other coin here in just a second, this other stack, because I really wanna show you the other one. Uh, now look at the eyes on this one. This one's just a little bit more detailed than the eyes. The jawline's a little more detailed. Uh, he really took his time with this one. Lots, of, Even on the forehead, you can see the different shadowing uh, techniques that he used there. Really, really, really cool. I'm gonna switch over to this piece dollar. Give me one second. Boom. This one I think is probably one of the coolest ones he's done. Uh, so on this one, he actually added a noose uh, around the neck of la poor Lady Liberty there. Um, it's a little morbid, but like I say, really detailed, really cool. Uh, this isn't for everybody. Not everybody's going to be a fan of these, but I know a lot of people out there really enjoy these, and I think they're really, really cool. I think this would make such an awesome collection. All right, we have another 1921, and you can see right there on the side of the skull, a lot more detail there, more shadowing. It's just a little bit different. Each one is just its own thing. Oh, now this is an 1882. Please. Oh, look at the eye on this one. I mean, this one looks like she might have uh, been through something dramatic here. The eye is really, really different. It almost looks zombie-like in, in a way. Very cool. I hope there's not a Carson City <laughs> mint mark on the back of this. Let's look right now and see. 1882. What's? It's an O. It's a New Orleans. All right. So it, at least it's not a Carson City. That that would probably make uh, make my heart drop a little bit. All right. We have another piece dollar. 1922. And I, I, we haven't even looked at the mint, mint marks on the, the peace dollars either. I'm afraid to look. Uh, but this one, pretty cool. All right. We have another peace dollar. Oh, this one's different. Look at the collar. Uh, the collar is a little bit different. It's kind of like uh, she's wearing maybe a, some sort of shirt there or something. Just something a little bit different. Each one's just a little different. This one, we got more neck bone pronunciation there. Uh, again, just something different. And we got a couple more. This one's flipped over. What is it? 1921. I was going to say most of the Morgans are 21s. These were probably all uh, cull 
uh, dollars that he picked that he probably picked up really cheap. And I double checked; they are silver. So, and this one's really cool. Now, see, this one's she's looking up. See how her head is turned upwards. They're not all like that. So each one, like I said, is just a little bit different. 1922. We got, looks like two more. All right, guys. Last two. Ooh, I like this one. I like, the, she looks like she's like screaming in this one. Like she's like, ah. like, like you see on uh, walk, The Walking Dead. Ah. <laughs> And the final one. Ooh, this one. I really like this one. This one's got a lot of good detail. Something about it. Uh, it just looks good. Aesthetically pleasing to the eye. It's a 23 piece dollar. So, guys, that is it. I gave you a closer look at the collection. I hope you enjoyed it. This is so much fun. So, there you have it, guys. That is the entire collection. 15 in all. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe. We will see you next time. And as always, happy hunting.